So yeah, everyone's excited, you know, coming back every year. It's one of the most exciting times of the year. You get to spend about three, four weeks, you know, with some of your best friends just doing football. And now, you know, ramp it up for our first game. Everyone's definitely excited for that. Honestly, I feel like we're in a really good spot. Like, compared to last year, I think, like, since we have, like, a lot of returners coming back, we're definitely in a much better spot. Like, we know what to expect. We know, like, the work ethic needed to, like, succeed. With uh, every class, like a class leaving, a new class coming in, every team feels a little bit different. Personalities are always a little bit different. So like the team feels different, not in a good or bad way, just different personalities. So I'd say that's really about it, is just managing who we are and finding our identity and not trying to be a team in the past. There's obviously going to be like preseason rankings, like Division Three football, they have like all their like big rankings, like all the top schools. And there's going to be like a lot of talk on social media. but. Obviously, like, we need to ignore that. We need to, like, go at our own pace, not just, like, at the pace of everyone else who's, like, scrutinizing us. We have to stay steady. We can't, like, let everybody else dictate what we're going to do. We can't let anyone else's banter um, take us away from our championship climb. I love that Coach Millen's taking the initiative to actually go put us on the road and go play these teams that are seen as like these powerhouses because we want to be that. It's very exciting, honestly. It was a little um, overwhelming playing like like obviously the national champion, but honestly, it's like a great experience for us to test our medal against the Crusaders. I think our offense is looking really good, especially like this year we're going to have a lot more um, running backs, so it'll be great. Like we have a lot more diversity. This year, I think we're like more steadily improving as the, as the season's going on. Defense looks really good. With every year, we have Coach David, who's a wonderful defense coordinator, putting us all in the right spots, and I think we're just looking to like know our spots and fly around. You know, at Muhlenberg, we definitely pride ourselves on our special teams. It's a, it's a phase of the game that we turned into an asset. So one of our goals last year was you block a kick every single game, and then our kickoff, kickoff return led the country last year. And you know, every time we started the ball over the 50-yard line, it you know, turned into points, and in the playoffs, it totally helped us. Just the whole operation's coming back, and we're looking at it being even better than last season. Obviously, you have your game day atmosphere. But personally, for me, I love practice. You know, because I love you know seeing my friends every day. Obviously, you know, competing against the best. We put our best on our offensive best on our defensive best every single day. So just having that level of competition on a daily basis has always been something you know that I've enjoyed playing football in Muhlenberg. I've thought about this a lot, and one thing that I would say is, um, when I was a freshman coming in, I always thought like the biggest thing about Muhlenberg football is how successful they were undefeated season finishing the final four but then as I started to get better and like started to start on the team I noticed the relationships that I've made with all the people on the team are like are lifelong they're gonna be like everlasting I love like every single member of the team like they're my brothers and so I would just say like the brotherhood is the best part about being on Millbrook football <laughs>